Hey everyone, um, today I'll basically be just be doing a review of this rosemary that I bought from Glingus that he custom painted with Perma Blood. Uh, she kind of works, but not really. I have her base right here. She's on, here's her base right here. She's on a whole different, no, she's on a whole different base. If you can see, let me turn the camera down. She's on a whole different base right there. But she looks pretty good. I think she's still the same height she'd be if she was on her normal base. Maybe even a little taller. So, um, yeah. Let me scoot you guys up so you can just see the amazing paint job Klingus did on this. So, he painted her face and her hands and her dress with perma blood. She looks amazing. Uh, actually, here, let me take you. Hold on. Alright, so he painted all of her with perma blood. She looks amazing. She painted her dress and her hands, her sleeves, and her. This looks way better in person than it does on camera. But he painted all of her wounds. He painted her chin and stuff. She looks incredible. Um, here's the base. She's on, uh, I don't, actually don't know what base he got this from, but, uh, she, it's working pretty good. It's just, it's just slid over her main pole, but she still has all of her wires intact, and I'm searching for parts to repair her with, so let me plug her up to her mech real quick so she'll turn on. All right. So she's plugged up. Um, I just need to find a new base and um, base poles, I'm pretty sure. And then I have a fully ro working rosemary. So I'm going to test that out. But here she is. She doesn't fully work. But um, we think it's just her, her um, motherboard. Hold on, she works sometimes, but sometimes she doesn't. Ah, hold on. Let's turn her off again. Turn her back on. Ah, right. well, it looks like she's not working now, but basically... When she was working, her mouth was just moving, and her head was turning a little bit, but not a lot. But, um, she's in amazing cosmetic condition. She's still extremely squishy, and she just looks incredible. Her hair has some stuff in it, but doesn't look too bad. So, I'm really happy with this. Um, huge thanks to Glingus. Because he packed a bunch of other stuff. She was ex packaged extremely well. And he even gave me some funny random stuff. But he did give me this 2009 uh, Morbid Industries Gorch. I mean 2006 actually. This 2006 Morbid Morbid Industries Gortrit. It's pretty cool. Let me see if I can show you what it does. And then he gave me some other st stuff that he found funny. Um, but she was a packaged extremely well. Make sure to check him out. I'll link his Mercari and his YouTube channel. Um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next video. Alright, this video I'm just kind of trying to see if Rosemary will work. If she'll turn her eyes on so I can see if that works. Need new batteries. That could that could be a problem, huh? Yeah, she can, she runs on battery or adapter. How did you think she's been turning on? No.
She just stops. But earlier she was going for a little longer than that. So I don't know what it's. <clears throat> I'm gonna replace the batteries and see if that fixes anything. All right, so I put new batteries in her, and she's she's fully working now. She just went. She just fully worked. Well, she fully works. The only problem is her, her, right, her mech, her, well, her base or whatever you want to call it. This has nothing to stop it when it moves, and it just pushes all the way down. So this has nothing to stop it. So I have a fully working Rosemary. Her base is just broken. So, I think if I were to get new base poles, or just put this all back together, but she would not be able to come apart, I would have a fully working Rosemary. Um, so, this was just a quick test video. She went through her entire thing, and she all she really needed were some new... Her batteries popped out. That may, might be why she shut off. She, I think she just needs new batteries. She just needed some new batteries and a new base pole or whatever. So that's really cool to see. Um, thank you guys for watching. doesn't look like there's good lighting but you'll see why in a minute i'm just gonna i fixed her all up well not really fixed i took apart her base so that one pull that moves wasn't clicking and whatever so i kind of just took that off i put all the pieces in a bag here hold on there's all the pieces i took off of her base i took them all you can't see it good i took all the pieces off and she's fully working all, well, she'd be fully working. Everything works. The laundry works. But I don't have her on her base because I took it apart. But if I were to get her a new base, she'd be fully working. But um, here she is all fixed up. <laughs>
I don't know how good you can see her mouth movement on camera, but she her mouth movement is amazing. She's an incredible piece, and I'm so happy I got her. Well, basically, there she was. Let me turn on the lights and then demo her again so you can see her. All right, here's all the lights on. She looks super creepy. Lingus, I can't stress how much of a good job he did with the paint. He painted literally, like, everything from here all the way down, and she just looks amazing. Um, okay, I had to make sure my camera wasn't clicking. She's on um, a whole different base, like I've said before. This will be uh, probably the final video of the series of Rosemary and whatnot. I forgot to record me taking apart her base and stuff, which really sucks. But here she is demoed in the light, where you could probably see her move a lot more. I put some tape over her speaker so she's not as loud because she's like really loud and she does not have volume control which is really weird but she's an incredible piece and I'm so happy I got my hands on her I, I love doing this so so much because let me show you the other thing he gave me which I already showed but I'll show it again boom 2006 Gortrit And it was made before Morbid Enterprises became Morbid Enterprises. They were still Morbid Industries. So, I got that. And then he gave me some funny inside joke stuff. So, huge thanks to him. A list, his Mercarian YouTube channel will be listed in all of the videos. So, go check him out. Maybe even buy something from him. Um, Thank you guys for watching.